the fit to box fitness gloves world cup for gloves under 30 english pounds or under 35 us dollars this is the final Hello and welcome to fit to box channel I'm coach Simon and here on fit to box channel I bring you all things boxing equipment. Today I have the final of the fit to box fitness glove world cup. Of course you have seen the videos of the four contenders, you have seen the semi-final one, the semi-final two and yesterday we had the third place uh, playoff match um, which we did with the outshock Decathlon Outshot Glove becoming that bronze medal winner. Today we decide who is the gold medal winner and who is the silver medal winner and who will be crowned as the fit to box Fitness Glove World Champion and that will go into that new division that will be on my website fittoboxchannel.com. So let's go through the contenders for this final and we have the Star Pro M33 Dynamic, £29.99. And we have from RDX, the RDX F4. Again, another glove, £29.99. So let's start off the six rounds with round one, style. So the Star Pro M33, this actually comes in four different colours. And each of the colours do look good to be fair and I like what they've done with the stitching as well being the same colour as the actual logo at the rear. And what they've done is they've used a, a, like a rubbery synthetic for the material of these gloves and on the front they've got little bits of high quality mesh given that this is a glove under 30 English pounds. You've got there no compromise, you've got the SP of Star Pro at the back and M33 Star Pro and the logo and then on the front sort of nothing else apart from that mesh. Then we come on to the RDX and RDX as always have got the logos all over the glove and you've got RDX there. Uh, they've even got what they do on the more expensive gloves. They've even got uh, actually, as I, if I can show you, there's loads of logos even, even underneath even underneath the, the strap, they've just put loads of logos as well. So this particular glove, I think out of the two of these, I am favouring the RDX. It comes in loads of different colours, and I think that is 10, 9 when it comes to style. Round 2, comfort. As I put on the Star Pro, short, up the arm and in the wrist, the Velcro goes across and then you've got a nice rounded punch surface with lots of padding. Good protection in the knuckle area. You've got a flat pad at the front there which you can almost like feel the mesh of it but it's not rough. And then you've got comfort that is behind the first sort of knuckles and the fingernails. So that is fine. Thumb as well is comfortable on these gloves. Okay, and then with the RDX, put these on and they've gone with that, not only the Velcro strap, but they've gone with the elastic attachment as well. And you bring that round there. And again, we've got a comfortable glove in terms of the finger area and also the thumb. This is a close round, but I am going to give it 10 points to Star Pro, 9 points to the RDX F4. Okay, then we come on to round three, durability. Durability, this one here, it's called Calyx Skin Myohide. That's the synthetic material that they are using. It's really well stitched, really well constructed, as with all, I have to say, RDX gloves. And then, again, we've got a synthetic, as I've said, rubbery leather on this one. Good construction, good stitching, another close round but I am going to give it 10 points to the RDX and 9 points to the Star Pro. 
round four, and that is sparring. Okay, so when it comes when it comes to sparring, you've got that round amateur style sort of punch surface. I would prefer it if that wrist was a little bit lower, but these you can open up no problem, and they are good in sparring. With regards to the RDX, the punch surface is a little a little squarer than this one. You have again got a good wrist support on these. This one goes slightly slightly further down the arm, which I do like. But I have to say, when it comes to sparring, another close round, but I am going to go 10 points to the Star Pro, 9 points to the RDX F4. Then we come on to round number 5, and that is bag. On the bag, you've got a really nice punch surface with the RDX. You've got that longer cuff that gives you a bit better support when it comes to the wrist. And also with that elastic as well, really does give you that strength that you need in that area. And so on there, you've got a five layer padding. You get, uh, with this glove here, you've got good protection across the knuckle area. It's a comfortable glove, but when it came, when it comes to using them on the bag, I did prefer this one. 10 points to the RDX, nine points to the Star Pro M33. Then round six, value for money. Both of these gloves are £29.99. They are both great value for money, I have to say. Bearing in mind, £30. It's not a lot to spend on a pair of boxing gloves. I can certainly see these being a great introduction to sort of higher gloves as you get more into the sport. But both are really well constructed. Both are really well stitched. They're both great uh, when it comes to sort of use, whether you're going to be using them on the bag or whether you're going to use them in sparring but for £29.99 I do give the edge to the RDX with 10 points and the Star Pro with 9 points. So that brings me to the end of the contest and now it's time to announce the score and the winner. And so the scores are 58 points to 56 points. And the new fit to box fitness glove champion from RDX, the F4, the winner of the fit to box fitness glove World Cup, the gold medalist in this particular competition. Now, this glove here is getting silver, so that is going to be the number one contender in that new division that I am going to create. So if you go to my website now, which is fit2boxchannel.com, you will be able to see that new division in the price division section of my website. But I've only got one more final thing to do, and that is to put on screen. Firstly, I'm going to put on screen the Star Pro, the card there, and I've gone 84 for style. I've gone 85 for comfort, 85 for durability, 88 for sparring, 88 for bag, and value for money, 88. That comes out at 86.3, above average, and an above average score in a division where the gloves are under 30 English pounds or under 35 US dollars. Above average score of 86.3 is a, a really high score. And then on the screen now, I'm gonna put the champion, the new champion, RDX F4, Style 87, Comfort 84, Durability 86, Sparring 87, Bag 89, Value for Money 89, making a total of 87.0, again above average rating in the fit to box rating system, which I'll put onto the screen, but we have a worthy winner and both of these gloves, in truth, if you're only paying £29.99, you won't go wrong with either of these gloves. They both are really, really great value for money and both score above average. I hope you've enjoyed the fit to box Fitness World Cup. I hope that you'll look on my website, fit boxchannelcom where you will see the new fitness glove price division. And you will also see that the previous featherweight division now has been crunched up a little bit. 
So the featherweight division used to be from 0 to 50 English pounds. It is now from 31 English pounds to 50 English pounds or 36 US dollars to 60 US dollars with the fitness glove division sliding in underneath that with for gloves below 30 UK pounds or 35 US dollars. So I hope you enjoyed that. I hope you've enjoyed the World Cup. I like to do like one of these a year. Uh, last year it was a, a different sort of World Cup. This year I wanted to go for the lower cost gloves for those people that start in boxing for the, who don't want to spend too much. And I did understand that you know sometimes people did not want to spend 50 pounds on that first pair of gloves. And I've always wanted to show on my price divisions across the board and it was a little bit unfair that the featherweight champion at just under 50 pounds was being compared to gloves like these which are under 30 pounds so i needed to make that sort of distinction and i'm glad i have and i'm glad that i've done that world cup and we have a worthy winner in the rdx f4 i hope you enjoyed that please like and subscribe to fit to box channel and i shall speak to you soon